Hello and welcome back to the Spanless Gamer. Today we're playing Barnstorming for the um, Atari 2600. We'll take a look at the box. Came out in 1982. Better look at the box. Well, there's your fun fact. Steve Cartwright was the uh, guy who signed the cartridge box. Famous for that. Back of the box is what? Conceived and designed by Steve Cartwright for one daredevil flying ace at a time. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting one of the most hair-raising, heart-stopping, and breathtaking video games ever to great fly across the TV screen, Barnstorming by Activision. You'll be amazed as your small but sturdy biplane, flying inches off the ground, actually zooms through barns, soars over windmills, and dodges flocks of pesky geese. And you're at the controls. Don't be afraid. Climb into the cockpit and take off with Barnstorming by Activision. Happy landings! Okay, so I don't have any fun facts for this game. Mostly you don't want to hear my jingle again. Okay, so this is Barnstorming. Obviously I'm doing pretty good so far. Okay. So, geese just bounce off me. It's like Flappy Bird, but not. Boy, oh boy. This is barnstorming. Wait, can I fly through the barns? I mean, it is called barnstorming, right? Yeah. Aw. Aw. Who put that there? Okay. Oh, so there's a number I'm supposed to fly through. Four, three. Got three more to fly through. Two, one. And I've successfully stormed the barn. Yay. Is there more to this game? Uh, or did I win? Oh, let's try game two. And the button doesn't seem to do anything. I don't... Yeah, this is... This is it, huh? This is the game. Yay. Yay. So fun. No wonder kids used to play outside more often. Ooh. So terribly thrilling, barnstorming. Got a pretty sunset back there, though. That's kind of cool. Well, although I can see this being fun for speed running again. It's one of those just kind of fast, twitchy games where you just have to get, you know, get good at, have good reflexes, try to improve your time. Yay! Well, you know, when you look at the graphics, though, it's cute. Like, you can actually see that, that the guy in the plane has, like, a little flapping scarf on. That's pretty impressive for an Atari game. Yep. I guess I win. So. Okay. Well, let's rate this game. So, graphics... I'm gonna give graphics a uh, five. It's because they're, I mean, they're good for an Atari. Sound, two, music zero, story zero, controls. You go up and you go down, two. Funness, one, does it hold my attention? Nope, overall we're giving Barnstorming a two and a half. I could see how it'd be fun for speed running challenges, but beyond that, not so much. Yep, Cooper agrees, okay. Please like, subscribe, we'll see you next game.